Hello? My queen, are you sober yet? It's so chaotic outside. What happened? Some unscrupulous media suddenly published photos of you and Fuboya. They even came up with a scandalous title for it. Now the whole Huayan, no! The whole cosmetics industry is talking about it. What? How did this happen? I didn't see Fu Boya yesterday. All right, stop talking, get changed. I'm heading to your place now. I'm afraid the reporters will block your door later. Where is Gu Cheng? He went to Huayan with Situ to deal with it last night. What are you thinking about? Hurry up! What can I do? Anan! Sixi, get in the car. Seatbelt. They're out of the house now. They should be going to her friend's place. I'll send you the address. Situ Shou said many reporters are rushing over to the house of Gu. I'm afraid you can't handle it alone, so I'll take you home first. Situ Shou and Gu Xicheng went to the company to deal with this last night. I believe everything will be fine soon. Don't worry. What's with the photos? You were with me yesterday. Have you seen Fu Boya? But I did go out for a while. Maybe the photos were taken at that time? But why? Don't think about anything now. You'll find out sooner or later. It'll be fine. Let's go. I heard Mr. Gu has a fiancé. Really? Of course. I heard that his fiance cheated on him. She even cheated with someone from our rival group. The landlady is really amazing. <clears throat> Vice President. Don't mind what they say. They don't know anything and still talk nonsense. It doesn't matter what they say. What the media says is most important. I've invited some familiar media and reporters. There will be a conference this afternoon to clarify this. Everything will be solved. As for Grandma, I asked Aunt May to go out with her. I hope everything can be solved before she comes back. Thank you, everyone. I'm Gu Xi Cheng. Miss her. Miss he. Miss he? Who is the man in the photo? How long have you known each other? Stop filming! No, I didn't. Stop filming! Stop filming! You! Stop filming! I didn't! Stop filming! Stop filming! She she! Stop filming! Stop filming! No, I didn't. It's not like that. Say something, Miss he. Miss he, please say something. Miss he, can you accept our interview? She she, let's go. Who is this? Miss he. Miss he. Miss her, Miss he. Miss he, please say something. Stop filming! Miss He. Stop filming! Miss He, can you explain? Stop filming. Miss He. Go away! Go away! Stop filming. Miss He, Miss He. Please say something, Miss He. Miss He. Miss He. I'll leave this to you. Everyone, I have something personal to deal with. I'll see you tonight. Sure, Mr. Gu.
Did anyone follow us? Don't worry. It's safe here. I'll call Zi Chung first. I want to talk to you alone. Those photos? There's no need for that. Boya, I trust you completely. We haven't met in the past few nights. How could there be such scandal photos? It must be made by someone with ulterior motives. Or the reporters just came up with it. They wrote it casually. Casually? We never have any scandalous relationship between us. Boya, you are my friend. You also kept all my secrets for me. Someone not only wants to sow discord between me and Shi Cheng, they even want to hurt our friendship. I'll call Zhi Cheng now to clarify on it. Su Yang Shi. Why do you always think for others? Can't you be selfish? Can you think for yourself? Boya. What's wrong with you? Or. You know something? I did it. What do you mean? I did all this. Yesterday, at the bar, I changed the wine that you and Lu Anan were drinking. I sent her away. I took the intimate photos with you and sent all the photos to more than 10 media and reporters. I also told them you were at Lu Anan's place. I did all this. Fu Boya, what are you talking about? You did all this? Why? For... Nangong. Nangong Liu Li. She is the one I love most. Let's go, let's go. Hello. Hello. Are you Chinese? Hang in there. Don't sleep. Don't be afraid. I'll call an ambulance for you. Hello. Someone was hurt. I'm on the 5th street. Get them over. Get them over. Don't sleep. Hang in there. Talk to me. What's your name? Those years abroad were the hardest days in my life. I almost gave up on myself. Until the moment Nangong appeared, a ray of light shone into my dark life. I fell in love with her, although I know deep down in her heart she loves someone else. But it doesn't matter, as long as I can stay by her side. That's enough. For me? I get it now. I want her to be happy. I hope she can be happy. Even if in the end, I'm not the one by her side. It doesn't matter. My life belongs to her. No matter what I need to do to repay her, it would never be too much. When she knew Gu Xicheng had a girlfriend, that she was in great pain. Seeing her in pain, my heart feels like it's being pierced by needles, being cut by a knife. I, I felt worse than her. So, I decided to destroy the relationship between Gu Xicheng and his girlfriend. Are you still the fool boya? I know when I was young. I'm sorry. I let you down. So, I tried everything to get close to Gu Cheng's girlfriend. I even drove around your house to find a way to establish a relationship with Gu Cheng's girlfriend.
Miss... Miss... Miss, are you alright? That day... You crashed into the taxi I took. You even planned an accident. I calculated everything. But I didn't expect Gu Cheng's girlfriend to be you. This is ridiculous. So you joined the collaboration between Huayan and the German company on purpose? I heard that Gu Cheng intended to collaborate with Lippmann. I knew they were lacking a third-party general consultant, so I went to Lippmann uh, and offered him a price he can't refuse. You really put all your effort into it. But I never expect you to fall in love with Gu Cheng. No matter how I treated you, you don't feel anything. I had no choice. So I had to find someone to take photos of us at the bar. Stop talking! I really don't understand. You hurt others to make the person you love happy? Is this your so-called love? Are you crazy? Do you know you've hurt others? You'll cause a mess in Huayan? Why do you have to do this? I don't care about others. I only did it for Nangong. Xi Xi, if you are willing to give up Gu Cheng and return him to Nangong, I will announce to the public that it was all my plan. I'll take full responsibility. Fu Boya. Xi Xi, you and Gu Cheng are not suitable for each other. As long as you give up your love for him. Fu Boya, I treated you as my friend. I didn't expect you to be such a person. From now on, I don't want to have any contact with you anymore. Just pretend that we never knew each other. Xi Xi. Xi Xi. Xi Xi. Xi Xi. Xi Xi. Let's talk about it. Let go! I have nothing to say to you. Let go! Xi Xi. Don't forget. You have another big secret. Let go! Fool boy! Uh. Fuboya, I don't care who you are. I don't care what you did. If you keep pestering Sixi, I'll beat you up every time I see you. Fu Cheng, please don't! We're not done. I'll settle it with you slowly. Don't be angry. I'm not angry. It's just too messy today. I'm confused too. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. I shouldn't have trusted others so easily. I shouldn't have gotten drunk outside. Because of me? This mess happened. I'm not afraid of the mess outside. I'm just... I'm just afraid that they'll hurt you. Shishi. I won't let them hurt you. No matter what happens. No matter what it takes. I will always protect you behind me.
Si Chang. I want to tell you something. Go ahead. Wait for me in the car. I'll be right back. Go. Hello, boss. What happened? This is serious. A reporter told me that. Fuboya just called the reporters saying that he wants to make a statement about the situation. Fuboya? What is he up to? He's making a scene. He seems to have more than one trump card. I don't understand it either. But we have evidence that shows Fuboya and Nangong Liuli studied abroad together. Nangong Liuli? I was also surprised when I found out. And we have evidence that shows they are friends. But I don't know if they have any other relationship. She took go and check the whereabouts of Nangong after she joined Huayan. Gather all the evidence that we can get and send more manpower to the conference tonight. Don't let them get close to Jixi. Okay, got it. Is everything okay? I'm here. Everything will be fine. Relax. There will be a news conference in Huayan's hall tonight. I'll clarify everything. News conference? Let's go. Miss Nangong, your boyfriend asked us to give you a letter. Oh, yeah. Mr. Gu, Mr. Gu, Mr. Gu, Mr. Gu, what do you think about this? Mr. Gu, is your relationship with He Jingxi real? Mr. Gu. Xixi. NNN, why are you here? The live streamers are also here. Look at the camera. Please say something, Mr. Gu. Mr. Gu, don't go. Mr. Gu. Please say something. Tell us what happened. Please give us an explanation. Mr. Gu, is it true? Mr. Gu. What do you think about this, Mr. Gu? Do you want to clarify it, Mr. Gu? Please stay calm. I'll tell you what you want to know. The scandal regarding my fiance cheating on me is fake. She and Mr. Fu, who is in the photo, are just friends. My fiance and I 
have a very stable relationship. As the president of Huayan Group, I assure you that this fake news will not affect the launch of our new product, nor the fluctuations of the company's stock. You're all talk. How can we trust you? Do you have evidence? Can you explain it in detail? Fake? What's going on? What do you want to say? Why would you say my relationship with Zixi is fake? Can you tell us in detail? Tell us more. I'm the other person in the photo. If you want to know the truth, shouldn't you interview me? Then please tell us. Do you have anything to say? Tell us what's going on. Tell us something. Just as you thought, Mr. Goo's fiance and I are exactly what you imagined us to be. Miss He Jingxi likes me. Not Mr. Gu Cheng, the president of Huayan Group. Who boy are you? Just stay here and leave it to me. Do you have anything else to say? I have more to say. He Jingxi used her identity as the fiancé of the president of Huayan Group to steal everything that belongs to Miss Nangong Liuli from the R&D department of Huayan Group. All her designs and everything else came from plagiarism. It's all fake. Do you have any evidence? How could this happen? Can you tell us in detail? Are you done? Sit down. This is the CCTV picture of my fiancé at the bar on the day of the incident. It clearly shows that after she and her best friend ordered the wine, someone switched it. After she was drunk, someone sent her best friend away. While she was in an unconscious condition, someone secretly took photos of her and Mr. Fu. Also, this is from a few weeks ago. A private meeting between Nangong Liuli and a private car driver. Because of Nangong Liuli's personal grudges, she tricked my fiancé to the suburbs and almost put her life in danger. When I got the evidence, I never wanted to make it public, but my tolerance and compromise towards you doesn't mean you can keep pushing me and hurting the person I love. Fu Boya, you and Nangong Liuli have reached my bottom line. From now on, she's no longer an employee of the Huayan Group. I'll give this evidence to my lawyer. You will take... full responsibility of the things you did. Don't worry. Is this true? Do you have anything to say? You were criticizing Mr. Gu on the stage just now. Please explain. Do you have any evidence? Please explain. Please say something. Please explain, Mr. Fu. Please explain. It's fake. These are all fake. These materials are all synthesized. You have to believe me. I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. Trust me, I'm telling the truth. Trust me. Do you have any evidence to prove it? Please explain. No. No. I can't give up like this. I can't give up. Nangong is waiting for my good news. Please tell us in detail. Yes, please tell us, sir. Please tell us. Please tell us. Please tell us in detail. Yes, please tell us, sir. Do you think this is over? It's impossible. Listen, Gu Xicheng. Listen carefully. Your beloved fiancé is not... Boya! Boya! Who is this? Who is this? Don't! 
Do you have anything to say? Please tell us something. Please tell us something. Please say something. Let's stop this. I did it. It's all my fault. I'll take all the blame. Miss Nungum, what did you do? It wasn't her. It's not her. It's not like this. It's not her. No, it's not like this. I did it, not her. I did it. I did it. It has nothing to do with her. Boya. Framing Mr. Gu's fiance, putting her in danger. Boya. And all those things I just said. I did all of them. Boya. It has nothing to do with her. What's wrong with you, Boya? Miss Nangong, don't you know anything? Boya. Have you never been involved? Don't give her a hard time. Please don't give her a hard time. No, no. Boya. Boya. Miss Nangong, you really don't know? I'll take the responsibility now. How are you going to take the responsibility? I will take the responsibility. I will take the responsibility. Boya. It's fine now. Boya! I'll turn myself in. Boya, wait for me. Nangong. Boya. 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 Are you okay, Boya? First. No, Boya. No. Boya. 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 Luli, I'm sorry. I hope in my next life, I'll meet you before Gucci Chung.